Welcome to my channel, Lifestyling Steph. So today I will be talking about five hipster things that you can do in New York City. A lot of these places are cheap and affordable. Some of these locations are very Instagrammable. Great photo opportunities. Number one is Bryant Park. In the winter season, I believe starting late October or late November, I forget when, um, holiday shops are set up and Bryant Park is completely transformed into a winter wonderland or what they call a winter village. Um, so they put in a huge skating rink and the great thing about the skating rink is that it is completely free to enter unlike most places in New York City. Number two is the new museum. So this museum is all about contemporary avant-garde artwork and specifically this one art installation called the Pixel Forest which is a bunch of lights and videos and it's just very calming and um, there's places that you can sit or rather sleep or lie down and just relax and there's a lot of music, a lot of video footage that is just supposed to make you feel like you're in another world. This art installation is only open until January 15th. The great thing about the new museum is that it is free for anyone 18 or under. Number three is Freeman Alley. It has perfect urban backdrops for your Instagram photos. And at the end of the alley, there is a very cutesy restaurant called Freeman's. It has that rustic, cozy vibe. Number four, I'm sure you guys all seen this on Instagram, but it's Black Taps. It's the place where you get those huge milkshakes with a plethora of toppings. So I went to the location in Midtown, right next to it, there is an avenue called Six and a Half Avenue. It's a gorgeous passageway, great for photos. Number five is Spots Dessert Bar. So I went to the location in Koreatown, which is in Midtown. 32nd Street. What's unique about this place is it serves bubble tea and light bulbs. It's known for its very photogenic dessert, and the great thing about these desserts is they actually look and taste good. And it is a fusion of Asian and American flavors. And that's it for five tips for things to do in New York City. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to thumbs up. And if you want to see more of these series coming up, subscribe. Leave a comment below on any place that you've seen on Instagram that you want me to visit. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to check out my previous video. It's a dorm tour. Well, it's a very quick dorm tour. All right, peace out.